Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Legacy Collection. In the last episode we beat Mega Man 2, so let's just continue on down the line. Mega Man 3! Let's do this. Okay, I promised myself in the Clash Man video I was going to hum, but I just can't help it. It's a song. Anyway, let's start with Mangikmon. I don't know why I started Mega Man. I think it's one I have the most comfortable, like I feel the most comfortable with this Buster. Which I mean, I'm going to have to Buster to the bosses anyway. Uh, because this game has a weird boss order. For some reason they decided to have five bosses have a, um, I guess a rock, paper, scissor, lizard, spock kind of deal to them. Then another three bosses have a rock, paper, scissors to it. So, I mean, if anyone wants to make the game magnet, hard, top, shadow, spark, um... Be my guess. Um, I'll be. I'll, I'll find funny if this. Actually, I can never time the slide right. Anyway, I've been blabbling. Never really talking much about the game. And there's really not much change since uh, Mega Man 2, except for the fact that we have slide, and that's what Pro Man or Blues or however you want to call him is here to tell us about, basically. And those little. Uh, Fight scenes, fight, fight rooms. Fight scenes, fight rooms? I have no idea what I'm talking about today. Ay, ay, ay. I've been playing way too much uh, PlayStation 4. And I bought myself a PlayStation 4 a few weeks ago. I've just been marathon running like Dragon Quest Heroes, Uncharted, um, Kingdom Hearts, all that fun stuff. You get down here and get all these nice little health pickups because I take way too much damage. Anyway, these disappearing blocks aren't hard, and I mess up on the second row of them. Why? Why? Why, why did I open my mouth? I need to learn not to open my mouth so much. Oh, 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 how you like that? How you like that? I was not even paying attention. That one already all... That one always worries me. Wow. Speech very much. Anyway. We're almost done with this first stage here. I haven't taken that much damage, so I don't think I need to backtrack for that uh, health pickup. How I take more damage? How did I take even more damage? I probably will take all that damage back if I went back to go get that, because you have to actually go, uh, go back through the room. Anyway. Didn't need to go back. Full health! I did not take any damage at all during this stage. Whatever you saw early, earlier were, uh, was fake news, and I literally walked right into that one, didn't I? Okay. Okay, seriously? So Magnet Man, as you can see, he can make himself invincible for short periods of time. Um... Shoots magnets that track you. If I'm standing underneath them or pass them whenever he shoots those, uh, they actually just go off stage. Okay, come on. I gotta get two hits on him before he finishes me off. Finish me off! In the back! Oh, man. Like a true he hero shooting him in the back. Can you tell? That's been a bit since I last recorded. Well, mostly because of work, and I've also decided that I want to do the whole dubbing thing. Um, nah, I have another project I've been trying to work on, like a review. I just haven't been able to get focus on that. I actually have a big YouTuber that helped me out with that, and I just can't hit it. I feel so bad for the guy that volunteered his time. But, to move on to Hardman. I'll get to the review eventually. I kind of want to do reviews too. I just wish I had like an actual camera to do it. Anyway. But, at the very start of this, we got to deal with bees! All the bees! That's a gimmick of the stage. For some reason, they decide that Hardman needs to have bees. I wonder if it's because Hardman is in reality Nicolas Cage, because he always goes hard for all of his great performances. 
Nicholas Cage does not phone in any of his performances. This is weird. My boss and I had my uh, job since it's just been the two of us. We literally ran out of things to talk about while we've been doing our uh, work. And we actually got into a lengthy discussion about uh, National Treasure and why the third one hasn't been made yet. Anyway. But, as you can see, this game also has Rush. I know I am just went from, like, point Z to point B. But, as I said, there really isn't much to start about other than to just play and not focus about it. Show off magnet uh, missiles. They just shoot magnets. How do they work? I don't know. Just shoot magnets. Um, I was not that high on the ladder. Uh, let me get the health. Because knowing me, now that I'm recording, I did do a practice run before, and I. Actually did a lot better than what I'm showing. Uh, I'm not going to waste more magnets. I can go before he hits me. Yeah. Make a man running away from all of his fights. Anyway. Line up here to, to kill this guy. Or get hit by him and take a crap ton of damage. Get an E-Tank, which I'm probably going to be using later on. Oh, come on. Lag. Oh, don't go down. Don't go down. Alright. Anyway, let's see if I can... Or not. I was going to try and do a screen, screen, screen glitch. I'm going to die here, aren't I? Wow. I don't know how I can show input lag and all the slowdown that just happened right there on the screen, but that definitely just happened. Uh, E-Tank's gone, so I probably should just go this way now. Take less damage that way. Now, let's see if I can do right this. I can't do it. What? 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 So, I kind of wish I show recorded my practice run because I was actually doing really good. And I didn't miss nine shots in a row on Pro Man here. At least I didn't take 5,000 hits from him. At least I'm at the end of the stage. At least I'm going to stop saying at least now because I've just said it so many times. There we go. Hardman is weak to magnet missiles. He also slams on the ground really hard. Freezes you somehow. Like, even it. Like, you're somehow stunned even in midair, even though he hits the ground. That, that makes no sense. Mega 3 does a lot of stuff that makes no sense. Hit shot! Also, taking my shot for that one for me, too. That makes, let's make that the theme of killing all the bosses. Me killing them from behind. I uh, don't know why I said it that way. I don't know if I was trying to be like a rogue. Anyway, with Hard Knuckle, it's uh, an attack that just shoots this straight forward. It's a lot like the Clash Bombs in um, Mega Man 2, where they can break specific uh, walls. But, we're now on Top Man stage. For some reason, it's in a greenhouse. The solar pan pan panels. So, I think I mentioned this before. I was dropped on my head whenever I was, I was a kid, and it gave me a speech impediment. So, I sometimes have a hard time speaking. It's also like me having a hard time playing this game, especially when there is lag of foot. Get this big health since I took way too many hits there. 
But, for some reason, Top Man Stage, we're in a greenhouse. Your guess is as good as mine? As I said before, Mega Man 3 makes no sense. Like, why, why are these little things here? I mean... They're those I always remember them as the little spinny platforms and uh, airships in Mario 3. But why are they there? Like... Ah. Anyway, let's use some Rush Coil to get up here. There's two other forms of Rush, which you'll see in this game. I try to use Marine whenever possible. You know, the Marine really doesn't get used that much. There's a reason why they stopped trying to make Marine a thing after, um, 4. And... Wow! I am getting all the dickens taken! Um, but Rush is definitely the, um, an homage to all the items from Mega Man 2. Um, where they had, you know, platforms and jets and stuff like that. Oh, I killed him this time. See, I'm doing better than my uh, practice run. Okay. Yeah, I was afraid that I was going to get killed with the spikes um, <laughs> this time around. Anyway, let's go ahead and use... Um, let's use all my magnets to kill that one guy. And we're now at the stage gimmicks! Tops! Yay, Tops! I, I knew there had to be some reason that, you know, this stage was talk called Top Man. Oh, and we're at the end! So funny! We finally get to the gimmick and we're already at the end of the stage. Top Man! How much to say about him other than he likes to be fisted. I deserve that hit. Now I'm just going to punch him in the face. All right. I, I, yeah. You know, it's kind of funny that you fist people from a uh, hard man's weapon. I'm going to stop right there. Anyway, next time on Let's Play Mega Man Legacy Collection. Uh, I spin to win. I don't know how I end this one. I'm just going to end it now. Have a great day, guys.